What does 100 great British pounds get you in non-league? In the 92, you get stupidly high match tickets, overpriced football shirts, and the most bang average food. However, today I want to show the value non-league brings and what I can get for 100 pounds. But the question is, which club will I be watching? Stop right there! I'm very close to hitting 50,000 subscribers, so subscribe and leave a like on this video and comment below which club you want me to visit next. The first clue I'm going to bring you is that we're watching a National League club. The next clue is that I'm at Peterborough Station, and the stadium I'm going to visit is actually sponsored by one of the train companies. And the third clue is, I'm so far up north that I'm having a nosebleed. Okay, I'm done messing around now. We're watching York City. I have never been to this city in England. And just looking around already, Exton is a train station. How beautiful it looks. It's just the way everything is built. Talk about a setting over this bridge and everything. Perfect weather for this occasion as well. Nothing but positive words to say about this city. Normally it's cities around Europe which you get excited about, but York in England, this is the first time I've been proper excited about an English city for a while. York Cathedral as well. I'm literally showing you everything today. This challenge does not start until I'm at the stadium. All my transport costs to get to this city does not count towards my £100. We start from neutral, £0, until we get to the stadium. The only way of getting there is by a taxi. You can't even walk there. It's a few miles away. Cheers, mate. Thank you. I have arrived at York City Stadium, and I cannot believe it's next to a Cineworld. World. It's next to, like, Starbucks. I feel like I'm at a leisure... It is a leisure centre. This is so modern, so new. It's brand spanking new. Because this is not, like, a normal stadium. I'm generally quite lost right now. I don't know where the club shop is. I don't know where to buy a ticket is. But I just know there's a cinema if I want to watch a movie. Oh my God, it's Ellis from Away Days. Away Days is here, Ellis. I can see the store, but where's, where to buy tickets and everything? I, I don't know. This has been such a maze. Like, I've never experienced a stadium like this before. And it's good to tick off these sort of stadiums. Right, here's the ticket office and it's a bit close. I haven't got a clue. I'm just gonna continue walking. I can't believe I'm actually looking at a map, but I'm here and I've just seen Ticket office, West Stand. I think I'm finally onto something here. Excellent. Perfect. Thank you very much. Thank you. Cheers. That is the match ticket secured. £21 for an adult ticket. To be honest, I cannot believe the price on that one. That is too much money. Next up on the list though is the club shop. What can I get? Can I get a football shirt? Can I get a scarf hat? What can we buy then? £79 remaining. To celebrate 100 years as a football club, York City released a limited edition home shirt, which I had to purchase and give away later in the video. And I must say, one of the best shirts I've seen this season as well. The club shop has been successful because I bought a match shirt, a pin badge and a bucket hat. What am I doing? But that came to a total of £59.19p. It's been quite successful. It soon came to my attention that I've probably chosen one of the most expensive non-league clubs possible. But that shirt is a beauty. Brought my total up to £80.19p with literally £19.71p to go. My bank account is hurting, but let's enter the stadium. Ooh, and we're through. This is so modern. You don't see it very often they got a concourse. They got live music playing. And this looks class. Look at this logo at the top, by the way. This is a proper concourse, and it's got all of my respect so far. Can I have a cheeseburger and diet coke, please? At a whopping £7.50 for a cheeseburger and drink, my bank is getting rinsed. So please leave a like on this video. Big, big fan. 8 out of 10 for me. You don't normally taste the cheese, but this one, you got a big lump of cheese. It's solid 8 out of 10. As we all know, I'm not the York fan around here, but I bought this shirt anyway. So, here is a medium York shirt. Brand new, tagged up, all bought. I've heard you're a medium, mate. There you go. It's an early Christmas present, like months before. Now, give me your prediction, mate. 2-1 uh, York. 2-1 York. Go on, tell me. I think 2-0 York. Manel John Lewis header. Yeah? Shakai 4. That is the most precise prediction I've seen so far. I didn't realise it's going to be a mugs and atmosphere today. Players have finished training. And by the way, they're playing Barnet. I never mentioned who they're playing. Yes, that is correct. It is 5th place Barnet versus 19th place York. The home side need the win to cement their place in the National League for another season. I did not. Expect this all that here. But I'm giving away a shirt now. It had to be done. I think it's going to be 3-1 York City. Come on, you Reds. What do you think, mate? 2-0. Uh, this is pre-match. And here come the teams. York City versus Barnet in the National League. I am done with spending money right now. The total I've spent today is on the screen. But nevertheless, it's rather football now. And we have kicked off it at York City, the Lunia Community Stadium.
there is, isn't it? Massive York fan goes to every single game, home and away. He's actually been organising a lot of the atmosphere, the flags, everything. So massive respect to you, mate. Full time score? Yeah, two 0 York with. Two 0 yeah. Really three. You've been playing well, aren't you? Yeah. And what about your fans, mate? I mean, it's class, from in my opinion. Just class. Every single game, get support and get behind them. And the game has kicked off again for the second half. Look at this, the pressure here. These fans are up for it. No! Oh. And then shut the ball up. At least the keeper's seeing the funny side. This could be two. Oh, oh no. What have we got? Uh, uh, Is that 2 0? Lenel John Lewis header. Yeah. I've heard. I've heard rumours. See if that rumour is true. It's not a bad ball. Here we go. It's still 1 0 to York here, leading up to the 90th minute of the game. 2 0. Oh, great save. The starts are out. Look 
Wow, what an atmosphere that was. And York City, what a club. £100 on a non-league fixture, and I probably chose the most expensive club to do this on. With that money, I bought the home shirt, a match ticket, a bucket hat, a pin badge, a cheeseburger, and a Diet Coke. And the total came to £87.69. But the main question is, was this good value for money for a National League club? 